I think the mission is clear. We're looking for economic impact. The Business Bank now has the potential to really make a big impact in the market. It's really, it's a privilege to be part of the system. Growth is back on the agenda. And there's a real sense that we have arrived. I can now say that over £800 million of new lending and investment has gone through our British Business Bank programmes. So I think there's a real sense of momentum and this just um, captures it in the moment. Well, thank you for inviting me here and it's great to see such a big audience. This concept, the British Business Bank, is something I launched at um, in party conference season uh, a couple of years ago and in the last two years we've travelled an awful long way. It's about transformation. The SME community is unquestionably a major part of Britain's future. What we need to do as the British Business Bank is understand where the market's working, where the market's not working properly. Because we're not charged with maximising profits, we can focus on some of those areas where the markets don't deliver the finance that these growth companies need. What we really have to do is make sure that we are listening to what the future needs of our economy are. Uh, I was just talking to one chap uh, who rescued Norton motorbikes, and it's a wonderful story of uh, you know, things that we think are history in our economy don't have to be. And I think um, Norton and Stuart are a great example of um, entrepreneurs getting out there and trying to do something different. Our big focus is to get the skill set and, and that supply chain sorted. So we've recently set up our own motorcycle academy, the British Motorcycle Manufacturing Academy, and started 50 apprenticeships in the last two weeks. The thing that I would say to everybody today is, is kind of go and turn every single stone over and kiss every single frog that's out there because the, the, it, it is there but you do have to go find it. The British Business Bank is working with 80 different partners to ensure that finance reaches small businesses and we're trying to encourage that landscape to be as rich and diverse as possible. As an entrepreneur and, and, a, and, a, and a business owner, we have to look at those multi-layers of finance and the old school way of having a traditional bank debt and some senior debt in the business, they seem to have gone. It needs those connections and you need to know the people out there that are doing it and they need to know a little bit more about you. We work with, you know, um, all sorts from advertising companies down to you know, people making bespoke oil products. Um, so it's really great for me to meet real companies. We have to ensure that small businesses realise their growth potential. If small businesses grow, then the economy grows and jobs grow. What we're doing is really um, fueling where most of the new job creation is going to come from, where new value creation is going to come from. You know, the FTSE 100 in 10 years' time will be replaced by companies that aren't even existed today. So it's really quite a thrill to be part of building, you know, the next generation of successes and corporations for this country.